ever grappled with multi-touch issues on your iPhone such as unresponsive or erratic touch gestures? Fear no more. This video guides you through several steps to troubleshoot and potentially resolve the problem. Let's delve into the step-by-step -step guide to fix multi-touch problems on your iPhone. First off, try cleaning the screen. It may sound simple, but dirt, oil or debris on the screen can interfere with multi-touch functionality. Use a soft, lint-free cloth and make sure to remove fingerprints, smudges and any other contaminants. Secondly, consider removing your screen protector or case. These can sometimes interfere with touch sensitivity. It's worth checking if the multi-touch issue persists without them. Next, give your iPhone a good old restart. This can help resolve software glitches that may be causing the multi-touch problem. Simply press and hold the power button until you see the slider to power off. Slide it to turn off the device, then press and hold the power button again to turn it back on. Fourthly, make sure your iPhone is up to date. Software updates often include bug fixes that can address touch-related issues. You can check for updates by going to Settings, then General, and finally Software Update, and install any available updates. Fifth, calibrating the touchscreen could improve its accuracy. To do this, navigate to Settings, then Accessibility, and tap on Touch. Select Touch Accommodations and turn it on. Follow the on-screen instructions to calibrate the touchscreen. Sixth, if you suspect a third-party app might be causing the issue, try booting your iPhone into Safe Mode if it's available on your iOS version. This mode disables third-party apps, helping you isolate the issue. If the problem disappears in safe mode, consider uninstalling or updating the problematic app. Seventh, if all else fails, try resetting all settings on your iPhone. This can resolve software-related issues without deleting your data. Navigate to Settings, then General, then Reset, and finally Reset all settings. Be aware that this will reset your preferences, including Wi-Fi passwords and customizations, so do back up any important data before proceeding. Finally, if none of the above steps work, there could be a hardware issue with your iPhone's touchscreen. Contact Apple support or visit an Apple store or an authorized service provider for professional assistance and potential repairs. Always remember to back up your iPhone before attempting any significant troubleshooting steps or seeking professional help to avoid data loss. In summary, this video has provided you with eight potential ways to resolve multi-touch issues on your iPhone, ranging from simple solutions like cleaning the screen or removing a case, to more complex steps such as updating software, calibrating the touchscreen and resetting all settings. If all else fails, don't hesitate to reach out to Apple support. Good luck with your troubleshooting.